Hey everyone, today I have my Pup Sugar must have box to unbox for you guys. This is the fall box. So, Pup Sugar recently this year went to a seasonal box. They used to come out monthly and they were $40 per box. And now they only come out quarterly, so four times a year, once for each season. And now they're $75 per box. So, I believe this is the third quarterly box that um, they've had. I haven't noticed much of a difference in terms of the actual items in the box. I was hoping that there would be more items in the box considering that they come out less and that you're paying more money. So we will see how this box goes. I remember liking the last two boxes, but they they seemed more like their regular monthly boxes to me, maybe with more of a higher value. I know that that's kind of what they were going for was they were just going to include more higher value items instead of more items. I would personally prefer more items because then you have a chance of liking more of the items in the box. Um, whereas if they only include, you know, five or six items still that are just higher value, if you don't like one of those items, then that is, um, the you know, pretty much a lot of the cost of the box and the value in it. So I'll hop right in. I will have a coupon code below for $20 off your first box if you guys have not tried Pup Sugar before. So they always include just a booklet, um, everything included in the box, some coupons, and um, some other information about the items. So a few of the items, um, I do already know what's in here just because they let us choose our colors and styles and stuff like that. So the first item, this is from Soya and KYC. And so I'm, I'm assuming this is like a wrap. So, I'll look through that at the end. I don't want to spoil myself for the rest of the box, but we'll take a look at the end. The next item that I see is from Tarte, and it's Tarte Skin Care. It's a tight and bright clay multi-mask. So, that's how that looks, and it's really pretty packaging. This is how the packaging for the mask looks, so... They've always um, sent out Tarte items, and it's a really good brand, so I'm always excited to get those. The next item is from Casery, and it's a phone pocket stick-on card holder. So you just stick this on. It says it fits most smartphones, and you're able to have your cards just in the back there. The next item is from Hum. And it, they're killer nails, so um, they're just a dietary supplement um, to help you have stronger, longer nails and hair. So I'm not sure if I'll take these just because they don't seem like gummies for supplements. I only take gummies, so I'm, I probably won't use those. And I hope there's another, like, well, I wouldn't really consider that a food item, but what I really loved about the Pup Sugar Monthly boxes was some of my favorite snacks I found in those boxes. They had, um, like, some marshmallow-type snacks that I found in there and popcorn and, and different, just different brands that I wouldn't have known otherwise. So I hope that these boxes continue to have some food items in it, unless there's one at the bottom of the box here. I don't see one. But I hope that they continue to do that just because that was one of the things that I really loved Pup Sugar for. The next item is from Jewel Smith and I got to choose the, the color on this. Um, so this is a cuff bracelet. I chose the rose, uh, rose gold for that. And it just comes in the little Jewel Smith case there. The next item, this is from Lipstick Queen. And... I'm not sure if it was this box or not, but I've gotten a Lipstick Queen lipstick before and some type of subscription. So I'm not sure if this is the color or not, but Method in the Madness. Oh, it looks like Manic Mauve is the, the color. So this is what the, the packaging looks like for it. And this is the color here. And I definitely... I'm pretty sure I didn't choose this color. I don't know. Maybe I did. Um, I don't remember just because it was like a month ago that they sent out the selections. So I'm not sure if I chose that or if they sent out random colors for you. And the next 
item. Not even sure what this leather thing is. We'll have to look through the, the booklet at the end for that. Um, this here, this is a accessory organizer. The brand is Umbra. So you can hang stuff on that and it gives you a picture of just detailing. Let's see. Everything's going to fall. Um, so then they have this, um, but wait, there's more. Open this flap to reveal this month's special extras. These, uh, these items are bonus free gifts for you to try in addition to the curated contents in the box. So everything else um, was under this flap. So these are just bonus items. So this might be, this is usually where they include like sample items, which might be food or um, just random things related. So let's see. So the first thing I see is five fresh fall laundry secrets. So, and this looks like it's um, manufactured for the Clorox company. So let's see what it is. So first they have from K Hall Designs. It's like a lavender satchel there. Um, and then they included the Clorox Zero Splash bleach packs. So it says you just throw in the washer. So they included those. And they also included some Makeup Melt Bliss oil-free makeup remover wipes. So you can always use remover wipes. I do love getting these in the boxes. And the last thing they included are some sunglasses here from Liz Claiborne. So these are actually super, super nice. I'm already loving these. Let's put them on, you guys. Man, these are like my favorite items in the box, and these are the special extra. All right. I'm loving those. Love it. Very pretty. Love the color and everything. So... Super, super excited for those. These are my favorite item. And like I said, everything that I just unboxed under that packaging was the special extra. So um, I'm actually pretty impressed. I didn't get the, the food snack item that I wanted, but um, I'm pretty impressed with the other items in the box. I really do think for the quarterly, for this box in particular, they stepped up their game in terms of the previous boxes. Everybody's gonna have a different experience with subscription boxes some months or you know some boxes I don't like and then other times um, uh, the boxes are great but I always go on and read reviews and I typically go to read reviews when I don't like the box um, and then usually I see you know everybody's commenting oh it was the best box in the world and I'm like really so um, but I personally love this box um, even for items that I wouldn't use myself it's a lot of great items that you can gift and that's one of the reasons I subscribe to subscription boxes. So let's go ahead and look through the book for the items that like I wasn't 100% sure. So the Soya and um, Kayo item that I first opened up, um, that is actually a scarf. So this is how it looks on. And let's just see. <clears throat> So that random like tray thing that I showed you guys that was like leather, um, that's from Tribe Alive. It's a leather marbled valet tray. So this is how it looks there. And let's just see. So this is how the, the um, card holder would look on the back of a phone. All right, so that's that's it. Um, so like I said, really love the box. Let me know what you guys think. If you want to sign up, the $20 off coupon code will be down below. I think it's just a link you can click on and it should just apply automatically. But if you have any trouble, let me know. Any other questions, let me know. And I'll see you guys soon. And have a great weekend. Bye, guys.